this video, I will show you the Alberta Water Well Information Database and illustrate how you might be able to find your water well drilling report. First, visit groundwater.alberta.ca forward slash water wells forward slash D forward slash. At the top of the page, you will see a number of tabs. Select Find Water Wells. You can search for your drilling report a number of different ways. You can enter your land description. You can search by owner name. You can search by selection on a map. You can search by the Groundwater Information Center or GIC well ID or by the test ID for baseline water well tests. You can also search by well tag number or you can search by survey legal plan. The most common methods to search are by legal land description or by owner name. Let's start with searching by owner name. An important thing to consider when searching by this method is the fact that the well record will be filed under the original well owner's name. If the land changes ownership, the well record will not change. Another challenge using this method is if you search for a common name, such as Smith, you will see that a high number of well reports are found. This will make it difficult to narrow down to one well record. Instead, you may want to search by legal land description. In this example, we will search for the northwest quarter of 14 township 53 range 17 and west of the 5th meridian and click search. You can see that a number of wells, eight records, have been found here. You can click on generate report and this will provide a list of all the well records on this land location. In this reconnaissance report, you can see all of the well records that are affiliated with this location and are in the database. In this example, we have some test holes, we have some decommissioned holes, we have a deepened well, and a number of new wells. You can select a well by clicking on the well ID which is on the left, listed on the left hand side. In this example, I would select the newest well record. It will open up into a separate window. At this point, you can either save or print the report. You can then close that window and go back to the database. If you wanted to select a well report by selection on the map, you can click on the by selection tab then click on select by rectangle, then draw a rectangle around the dots, and it will list all the wells in that rectangle. Sometimes the yellow dot might have more than one well on top of each other on the map. In cases like this, it's helpful to use the select by rectangle, and then select over one of the dots to see if there's more than one. In this example, there's only one well, but if I was to draw around the other dot, you can see that there are seven records around that dot. If you know the well ID, which is on every report, you can enter it here. So if I entered a report number, let's try 20220. Let's try well report 2020292 and click search. It'll pop up here. Then I click on generate report and again the report would come up. I Once more I can either print it or save the report. On every report, you will notice that there is a legal land description listed here, and there will be GPS coordinates listed here. For most reports, the GPS location is auto-generated by the database and not an accurate location. The dot on the map will be automatically placed in the center of that land location. Most often it's the quarter section, it could be in the middle of, of that section, or it could be in the middle of an LSD. 
Well tags and GPS locations are relatively new features for water well drillers to use when submitting water well drilling records. There may be some instances where you have difficulty finding your report. For example, there might be dozens of well records on a single land location, such as subdivisions or summer villages, which make it difficult to determine which well report is on your property. Perhaps the property has changed hands a number of times and you don't know the original well owner's name. Maybe the report is missing, or the report could have been entered into the database incorrectly, or the well is just too old and there is no well report available. If you're having trouble finding your well report, you may want to contact the Groundwater Information Centre for assistance at Alberta Environment and Parks by calling them at 780-427-2770 or by email at gwinfo at gov.ab.ca. You may also uh, find some helpful tips by reviewing the frequently asked questions listed here.